Hey guys, Mr. Idol Hack here, back with another video. Sorry about the background noise, it's my fans going mental. Because uh, I'm doing two fire scans at the moment, at the same time. Which you probably shouldn't do, but I'm, I don't have time, as it's 2am, so... I need it done as quick as possible, so having them both do at the same time might as well. Okay, so... I'm going to be teaching you today how to blur faces and license plates using YouTube editor. YouTube itself whatever so this can only be done once the video has been uploaded you can put the video private then edit it and then you can make it public and it'll go live so that's how you can do it so um, okay so you want to find the video you want to use first so I'm going to just demonstrate it with this one because I'll just show you now so at the start of this video you got the full license plate there as you can see so it's a good demonstration Okay, so you want to go into the video, so you press the edit button. Okay, and then you go to the editor itself. Okay, so now, you load it up in the editor. Then here it says blur parts of your video, so that's what you're going to be pressing. So if you press on face, okay, one scan is done. Cheat engine is in it, yep, how did I know, okay. Let me just close that off. So we're fine on viruses. Malware bytes is. I'm just uh, doing a scan because uh, I downloaded some dodgy stuff by accident. Well, I was, I was trying to download the game, but he installed some extra stuff with it, which I wasn't sure if it's part of the game or something dodgy, so that's why I got the fire scan going. Okay, so, anyways, uh, so here you got the face, face blur and custom blur. So, if you click on face blur, any faces it finds, it will actually show you them and you can click on which ones to blur out i don't know if you'll find any faces you might find one or two nope it's not going to find any faces in this one because there is no faces in this one we're literally just driving but yeah if it does find some it'll come up there and if it doesn't find it you can just blur it out yourself with a custom blur custom blur is what i'm going to use to blur out the license plate so i'll show you how to do that as well so if you're doing the close custom blur you can do rectangle, oval, they're the two shapes, and you can have it track. So if I put it on the license plate, I can have it track the license plate. So as he moves along when he's walking, like I'll show you now. As he moves along when he's walking right now, as you can see, that blur, instead of being in one fifth position, it's going to move with the license plate. So it does keep that blur, which means you don't have to, basically every time you move, you don't have to move it yourself and put another one in. Do you get me? Another blurring, so that's what this is for. So let me make that small. Uh, I wish I could zoom in. Actually, you can. Oh no, you can't. Mm. Okay, guess we have to work with that. Make it a bit smaller. License plate is about there-ish. Okay. So we want to track the object. Okay, track the object. So let's press play now. See how that works out. Does it work out well? Okay, no it doesn't. So, in that instance, you just have to keep going back and forward. I'll try make it bigger first. That's the first thing you can try do. Okay, okay, okay majority of it's out so what you're gonna have to do is uh, play around with it a bit get it perfect so say it's good up till about five seconds in so you cut it out the five seconds and put another blur in with the tracking one or with the bigger size one or whatever and then that's how you blur it properly so that's how you do it with youtube anyways and with the face one like i said uh, you just press it it shows up your faces and you just click on the ones you want to remove and blur out and that works pretty well as well, that tracks you as well, tracks the thing, so that's how you do it anyways, and then when you're done you press save, it'll process the video and uh, once it's ready it'll tell you, you just have to keep refreshing and check it, it'll take a few minutes, depends how long your video is and what quality it is, but yeah that's how you do it, my next one, on my next video, it'll either be after this video or before this video, I'm going to show you how to do the same thing, blurring with the DaVinci Resolve. So this is the latest version which is 17 I think or 7, I don't know what it is, 7 or 17. 
so that's what we're going to be doing in the next video uh, why might you use a uh, DaVinci it's just better quality and you can do it pre 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 before the video basically rather than after the video so and you can use that as a, it's a free video editing software so it's good in a sense you can do it all at once while it's editing and you get a better blur with that one so that's what i'm going to show you so stay tuned for that anyways guys thank you guys for watching please subscribe to the channel see you guys next time goodbye